And we're still in the grips of storm season. Could be more to come. Here's meteorologist Bob Gooseman. Yeah, at least we're in a, a bit of a break now because it's uh, more of a summer-like pattern out there, Dawn. And I think a lot of people will take the heat over the threat of severe weather. The unofficial beginning of summer, even though it officially begins on the 21st, People like to think of uh, Memorial Day as the unofficial beginning of summer. Feels like the real thing, though. There's no doubt about that. Storm track is across the northern part of the U.S. That's usually what it's like in the mid to late summertime, putting the threat of severe weather way to the north. Breezy warm weather pattern will continue. But talking about the feeling like it's summertime, 94 for a high, 98 Waco. They broke a record yesterday. Even though it looks really hot out here, temperatures were 10 degrees cooler. Today, out to our west, yesterday it was 110 in Wichita Falls, also 109 in Abilene, 110 in San Angelo, breaking uh, all time record May high temperatures. So, a very, very warm day yesterday. Today, not quite as bad for us. It was three degrees uh, cooler, if you want to call it cooler, than yesterday. Fair skies right now. A couple of showers tried to develop along the dry line, and we're just going to see what we call the debris cloud. There are no showers left over, but some of these clouds will move on over and then melt away overnight tonight. Then the low clouds will probably pull on up uh, just before dawn and last a few hours after sunrise tomorrow. So we'll go mostly cloudy if you have to get up on the Memorial Day and then becoming partly to mostly sunny again tomorrow afternoon. Looks like a good Memorial Day. What a, uh, a nice three day stretch. 80s right now, still close to 90 degrees. It is 91 right now in Abilene. Winds are still strong. Wind advisory was canceled as of 8 o'clock because the winds have come down just a little bit. But I think they're going to stay in this range, the 15 to 20 mile per hour range, just about all night. The dew point 65, so it's still relative, relatively humid. 89 is the current temp. There's that high, 94 this afternoon. A year ago, 95, so it was a little bit warmer one year ago today. Your average is 87 and 67, so the southerly winds are going to stay with us for the next several days. Dry line not nearly as active because of that air aloft is so warm. It's a summer-like pattern. You just don't get a lot of uh, a lot of widespread thunderstorms, more or less the hit and miss. And the computer models are trying to pop up a couple of thunder showers, but not much will happen over the next few days. Maybe an isolated storm or two. And it looks like a cool front will be moving through, but that's not the case because the ridge of high pressure that's keeping us warm is so strong, this will just drift on to the north and bypass us, keeping us warm just about all week long. So another windy, warm day tomorrow. Could call it hot to the west, very warm here in North Texas. So humid tonight, breezy, warm, some low clouds late, mid 70s by morning. Winds out of the south, southeast, morning low clouds, then partly to mostly sunny, windy, warm, 92 to 97. Next few days look summerish, mid 90s. Happy Memorial Day, looks pretty good. Seven day forecast coming up later, and Becky's got that forecast.